Bill told me three months after we met and I got my draft notice and I was drafted and I was sent for 18 months to Germany that it would be one of the best experiences I would ever have in my life and he was right about that. And when I came back after 18 months, I decided with the GI Bill that I could use that to get a college education. And Bill was, of course, a college graduate. And so I wanted to do that. And I started going to college four nights a week. And I was working full time at that same time. He did everything. I didn't make the bed. I didn't make our meals. I didn't do the laundry. I didn't do anything. And he said to me, as I was going to school at night and working at night, and there was always a meal ready for me when I got home, he said, John, you need to calm down. And I thought, oh, boy, <laughs> he's so right. So he bought me a paint set. And I started painting, and I have still continued to paint. I never had a lesson. And I went, I saw something in the summer when I wasn't going to school of a course at the Y, MCA. No, actually it was the YH, Young Women's, YWHA or whatever it is. And I went for the class and the guy, I, we all painted the same thing. And he said some things that made absolutely no sense to me. And I said, Screw it. I'm not going to go to get trained. I'm just going to do my thing. I'm not worried about whether it's good, whether it's real art. And in fact, I, I just completed getting all. I have some flower paintings, and I put them all in one place. And I've been hearing from people some wonderful things, and I thank Bill for that as well. When I was 22 and Bill first said to me, you need to calm down, and he bought me the paint set, Little would I know 60 years later, I was 22 then, I'm 82 now, that I'd still be painting. <laughs> and it's become my therapy. And I don't do it every week or maybe sometimes every three weeks, but something happens and some, for some reason I want to paint something and it, is the, I, it just calms me down. It still calms me down. And that's what he told me way back when. So I owe him another thing at this stage in my life.